Aha! Greetings everyone, it's me, it's Sharpie Buzz Potato. I wanted to personally welcome you back to what is episode 13 of Ghosts of Toshima. In the background you're watching a little samurai showdown between Jin and a straw hat. So uh, in this episode, just wanted to welcome you, wishing you a happy new year, and I hope you enjoy. This episode's got a slightly different structure. I've uh, pinned some more highlights together, so less so, not so much of a full playthrough, but more of a highlight reel of some of the more exciting things from the episode. So without further ado, let's get to it. Oh, oh, oh. Hello everyone, it's me, it's Sharpie Puss Potato. And uh, I've just ventured down this lovely big waterfall. I'll show you where I am on the map, just in case anyone's interested. It's in uh, north of Otsuna, which is in this secondary territory. Right here, next to the Lucky Genzo's Inn. And uh, I ventured down here, and there is a straw hat just meditating there. So I can only assume that we are about to get in a duel with him, so oh, let's not draw our sword before that's maybe disrespectful. Yeah, duel under falling water. Here we go. Ching. Okay, let's go. I understand. Oh. Nice. That was quite okay. Nin not not too bad. I got hit like once or twice. But we deflected a good amount of his stuff and we ended it nicely with the special move there pretty much. So yeah. Bow down and honor the fallen straw hat. Because at the same time, it seems that these straw hats aren't dishonorable. It's not like they're, you know, they're just fulfilling their job, what they were told to do. So yeah, also my um, controller is vibrating which means there's an artifact around here somewhere that I need to pick up. The question is where has he hidden it? Or, uh, I'll stop recording once I find it maybe. The water looks nice here. Maybe it's up here? Okay, I think it's getting stronger, the vibration, so it might be here. Maybe. Uh-huh. Flag. Maybe that's it. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that was what was vibrating there, so... Yeah, just wanted to show you that door there of uh, another straw hat. We're coming across quite a few of them now, to be honest. Like there, I think that's our third one that we've. So yeah, well that's a nice screenshot as well. Okay, so that's all I wanted to show you. So I'll see you next time. Aha! Greetings, everyone. It's me. It is Sharpie Bush Jin Sakai Potato right here, and you are joining me, rocking a slightly different outfit. I've. Uh, got a new die for my mask that was actually from the sake clan armor and as you can see a new sword as well really like this one it's just like black gold and red right really nice that's my favorite one so far 
And I'm rocking the red traveller's outfit with a nice red band. So yeah, Nobu's had a slight change of his saddle as well. He's rocking a yellow, yellow and sort of floral navy blue, like grayish sort of one. But uh, anyway, that's not why I'm here. Why we're here is that guy up there. See him? He is a straw hat. And I believe this is going to be another duel to the death. So let's see what he has to say for himself. Yuzo said you're the greatest swordsman he ever met. I had to see for myself. Okay, so this is it. This is going to be the battle to the death, I believe. So shall we? Shall we see what happens here? I'm just going to talk to him. You'd be better off taking his word for it. I've trained with the blade since I could walk. There's no one left to challenge me but you. Oh, among the spider lilies. I wonder why they're called spider lilies. Oh, because they look like little spiders. Like they've got lots of little legs. Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, God, that was fast, that one. Oh, oh my God, he's, uh, he's very fast. Oh, he's got a double attack, cheeky bugger. Oh, see, like he, he does a lot of double attacks, this geezer. There we go. That was nice and clean, kind of. I got hit a lot, but, you know. The straw hat down. You fought well, but we're finished. Give him a bow, show sign of respect. And yeah, that was it for another another duel. Finding a lot of duels lately during this episode, so I think with this episode I'll probably combine all the duels together so you can see them like one after another. Hello, hello, testing, testing, one, two, three. So we are back with uh, Jin Sakai. And we're just going to do this little puzzle together. A little bit of temple. So yeah, this is... Uh, oh, I don't know what temple it is, actually. Let's, uh, let's have a look at the map. Let me just get up here. And I will show you where we are and what we're doing. So we are here on the map. Uh, this is Scarlet Rock Shrine, it's called. It's uh, next to a Jumus Swamp and Field of the Equinox Flower. So, yeah, it's just uh, in the north region. Uh, yeah, so that's where we are and what we're doing, if you're interested. So, yeah, and this is just one of those normal shrines where you just, you know, need to do a little bit of jumping around and see where to go. Uh is in it? Ah, okay, so it's there. So, yeah, these are getting quite cool, honestly. Like, a bit more, not complicated, so to say, but, yeah. Oh, there's a flower down there. I have to get that on the way back. But, yeah, just, I don't know, they're getting more unique, I think. Like, a little bit more to do in each one. Like, you know, it's not now just climbing. It's, like, a little bit of swinging, a little bit of climbing, more swinging. Oh. Oh gosh, I didn't think I was going to make that. I thought I leaped off too early. It's fine. Okay. Yep. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Ah, oh, and we're here, I think. We made it. So let us honor the shrine. 
and yeah you get like a, a charm usually and some wax wood for like upgrading your armor and bows and whatnot so yeah hope you enjoyed that little look into you know yeah, there's our wax wood we just got. I always check behind because sometimes there's some some stuff like see wax wood again. Hidden. Uh, and you can ah oh, see there's a flower there as well. So it's always good to look around these shrines. You sometimes find like little bits and bobs that you might miss. Uh, and I want to go back and get that flower as well if I can find it. Because you can just. Oh, it's there. So let's just jump down. Oh, I forgot. I, I've got the uh, thing now where I can actually roll, but I keep forgetting to use it. Like before I hit the floor, I should push circle and then I do like a little roll sort of thing. Oh, there it is. That. Like that. See? There's that flower. Okay. And I think that will be it here. Oh, look, another flower. Lovely, lovely. Can I jump over there? No. But I can probably do this. Yeah, that'll do. Perfect. So we've uh, just completed another shrine there. You have joined me back here with Jin Sakai. I'm just trying to sneak up on these straw hats. Gonna hopefully assassinate one. And then chain onto the rest. Ah, oh, never mind. Ooh. I didn't actually mean to do that, but okay. That will do. That will do nicely. Okay, so uh, it looks like this is Mongol territory. So let's uh, let's take a look and see what's going on here. So we got a guy training there. Got a dog. The dogs, I wonder if the dogs can sniff you out. They probably can, to be honest. But I want to try and uh, see if I can stealth this up. I wonder, can I just kill that dog? Oh. Okay. Uh-oh. Ah, well, we can... They will be looking for me, but I am gonna... just want to kill that dog because I don't like the dogs in this game. Okay, going back in. Let's creep around. Oh, I expected to... Okay, they still didn't find out where I was, that's fine. Oh, 
Oh, gosh. I don't like these ones. They always catch me. There we go. Oh, that was nice. One shot, one kill on the dog. Okay, let's go, let's go. Who have we got left? Straw hat here. Let's go inside. There's something in here because my controller is vibrating to show that there is. Okay, we're gonna creep up on this guy. Oh, I dodged too early then. Take that. Where's that art check on? I believe. Apart from this guy who's still somehow alive. Now he is not. Okay, so I've just uh, reached my destination here. And yeah, it looks like uh, another fort to cleanse. So yes, Mongol territory. So let's go in. Um... I don't want to do a standoff. I want to try and stealth through it if I can. Kill enemies using a perfect parry. Okay. So we can try that. Can I fit through here? No, I cannot. Can we, maybe we can just leap in. Here you, Yasembe. Okay, Oh my god, they're everywhere. Ooh, got an achievement. 20 of 50 artifacts collected. Um, I'm in an awkward situation here, because I cannot... Oh, there we go. Oh, look, there was a gap there, if I Okay, can we? I was quite lucky. Oh, there's a lot of them going up there. Oh, that guy's going to see me. Let's try some wind chimes. See if we can... Oh, he's going to see me. Okay, let's try... So he should now be looking behind. Yes. Ha ha ha. Lovely. There you go. In we go. I'm not sure how I wasn't seen there. But next. That was maybe a bit loud. Okay, let's get to it. I need to perfect parry, so I like, need to time it perfectly. Oh. Oh, like that. 
Perfect parry them to be honest. Just time it like perfectly. There we go. Okay, and now we can just defeat the rest of them. Oh. oh, he set himself on fire. Old Clan's Hill. Looks like there are Mongols nearby. firing it. Okay. That was nice and straightforward. So yeah, I'll take that. Oh. There we go. So let's see what's around here. What's that? Oh, a nice big lantern. There's got to be something up here. Oh, uh, crickets. Singing crickets. Eight of 20. Doesn't look like there's anything else here. So it was just the crickets. Looks like there's a house up there though. We can go and see see what's going down in the house. Looks like there's a quest here for me. Just got these supplies. Oh that's nice. I like that. It's like a little hidden Buddha shrine. I was trying to fix my wagon with pieces from a bamboo stand when I was told a samurai had built it. Is that true, my lord? We use the bamboo to hone our skill with the sword. It takes focused blade to cut through all of the bamboo in one stroke. Please forgive my ignorance. I put everything back where it belonged, even the flag beside it. I appreciate that, but it would have been all right to repair your wagon. I'll make sure the stand sees use. So we've uh, unlocked the location of a bamboo stand. So probably up north, maybe. Greetings, everyone. It is me. It is Sharpie Piss Potato. As you can see, I'm approaching a Mongol camp here. Pissing Creek Crossing. So this is like crossroads. Um, I'm thinking let's just get rid of him first on top if we can. Boom. And no one should find his body because it's up there, so that's fine. 
and let's creak in. So again, the bonus objective is to kill someone with a perfect parry. So I think we can do that. I'm going to creep in here. Oh, I thought I could get through there, but I cannot. Oh, someone can see me there, so let's go around. We can kill this guy. Shush. Shush, sir. Shush. A fisherman. Okay, let's see. Can we? Can we? Can we? Okay, nice. Oh, okay, here's our dude. I need him to attack me so I can perfect parry him. Oh, and again. Come on, attack me. I need that perfect parry kill. He's setting himself on fire like a pop it on. Come on. Oh, I keep missing. There we go. Nice. Got him eventually. I believe that will be everyone here. Okay, so I have just arrived at this place. There's two kind of, I don't know, kind of like demon looking statues here. So, yeah, it looks like an abandoned temple. It's all mossy. So let's venture inside, see what's going down here. Got some uh, leather, by the looks of things. What is going to be in here, though? Uh, nothing. It's just a... Uh... Oh, look at that statue. That is a creepy looking statue, no? Look at that. That is creepy. What about his... Oh, even his... He's got little kids near him who are also very creepy. Yeah, these are creepy statues. Okay, um, I guess that was it there. Not much here, but, you know, there's something else around. Some spies there. No, doesn't look like there's much going on here. Oh, that looks like a dueling ground. I'm wondering if... There's something up here. There's a hole. Some supplies. Can't get up again. Some more supplies. Hmm. Thought there might be something more to this, but apparently not. Hmm. 
Okay, yeah, because this looks like a dueling ground now. Like, it's just a nice big open space. So maybe later, maybe something happens here. But yeah, for now, doesn't look like anything. Although, with that said, it's showing that there might be more here. Because it's still showing as undiscovered. So let's carry on looking. Maybe we'll find something or someone. Uh, looks like we need to head up this hill. Okay, here we go. Carter Farmstead, Mongol territory. Okay. Kill enemy with a sticky bomb. Okay, I do have some sticky bombs. Let's get him out of the way. Spotted. Almost, almost got spotted. Okay. So he will be our one to kill with this sticky bomb. There we go. Okay. There's one more here. Let's just go in and... Surprise! Okay, I think that's every... Everyone from this area. So I should be able to rescue her now. Save me! Yes. You'll be free soon. You'll be free soon. Thank you. Beautiful. Go. Be well. Okay. Kill the Mongol guards in the garden. So there must be more over here. And one more person to rescue as well. Quite a big garden, isn't it? Okay. Might be able to do a chain assassination here, maybe. Not close enough together. Oh, one shot. Ooh. down the house if he keeps firing at it like that. Is tracking me by the sounds of it. Oh. 
I think that's it. Let's go free the hostage. That was another job well done, I'd say. Hold still. How am I so fortunate to be careful up there? I wonder if the Jito approves. And there we go. Ricardo Farmstead is liberated. Perfecto. looks it looks nice during the day but during the night it's kind of creepy with all these like old trees and the overgrown moss sort of thing i don't think i'd like to live in this area okay so there's a legend storyteller here as well so we'll do that at some point but now i'm just gonna go and see what this last thing is he wants to show me Apparently somewhere here. Ah, uh, there. Oh, it's the fox den. We'll do the fox den. Come on, Mr. Fox, show me the way. Where is your little statue? Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Ah, is this set up here? Yeah. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, so thank you very much for watching again, and uh, I'll see you in a little bit. Hello, hello. I've just arrived at another location. We're heading over here to see what is here. Pillar of Honor. Oh, something new for us. What have we got here? Oh, a nice blue sword. That looks nice. Look at that. Gold Koi River. Let's have a look. That looks nice. I like that. That will match nicely with some of the outfits that I will have planned. I like the white, the white and the blue. Looks good. Okay, perfect. So that's another honoured shrine right there. Oh gosh, look. These are all like graves, no? I think. Yeah, gosh, like mass graveyard here. That's a lot of graves. There's a banner there that I can grab. That's a lot of graves. Anything here? No. Okay, so I believe that is it for that. That looks nice. Okay, so that was that. On to the next one. So I just saw on my map that there's a haiku here that I haven't actually done. This was uh, like back in the starting zone. So yeah, let's do this haiku. Reflect on serenity. Okay, what have we got here? Clear skies and clear mind. I like that. Feel the earth below. Whispers through the trees. I like the clear sky and clear mind. What about here? A cool bed beneath the stars. Swaying freely in the wind. Protected from the harsh sun. I'd like a cool bed beneath the stars. A sturdy defense. Growing ever strong. Beckoned by the warmth. Um, I think growing ever strong is nice. Clear skies and clear mind. A cool bed beneath the stars. 
growing ever strong. The old man was right. My spirit feels at peace, strong. That's I good. I compose more poems. There we go. Nice. And I think there's also something nearby that I haven't discovered, apparently. Just over here. And I'm not sure if it's like a shrine or... But as you can see, we're at the hot springs. This was right at the start when we were training with Ishikawa. Where we were defending from the very first batch of Mongols. So... Oh, that river's loud. But where is it? Where am I going? I think I need to go down. Yeah, it's down here. The question is, can I jump in there without killing myself? It looks quite shallow. Maybe we'll climb down. There's something behind this? No. Oh, it's down here. Ah, oh, legend storyteller. So we'll come back to him. I want to save the legend uh, storytellers for another time. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like I've got too much left on the map to... Actually, I mean, there's this massive area here I haven't explored, but I mean, there's no question marks left on the map. So I will need to do a bit more exploring, I believe. So yeah, join me, join me next time for, and see how my exploring goes. Hello, hello. So you've just joined me. I am heading into this. Uh, oh, look, there's a cat. I've never seen a cat in this game. Can I pet it? I can't, but that is a nice cat. It's not scared of me either. Oh, look at that. Big old stretchy, stretchy cat. <laughs> That's a funny looking cat. Let's take a screenshot of Mr. Cat. <laughs> Looks like he's scared of me. That's good. Okay, uh, anyway, as I was saying, is I am here to upgrade my armor. So um, I believe I've got enough resources now to upgrade. So we'll see which looks my cool. Armor will dull the Mongols weapons. And let's see. What would you like to improve? Okay, Ronin armor. So I don't use the Ronin armor very much at the moment. So maybe Gasaku, oh, Saka clan armor. I can upgrade that. Oh, that looks cool. So that's how it looks at the moment. But look at that. That looks badass. Yes, definitely upgrade that. that this awesome. will protect you. Yeah, it will. Oh, I can upgrade again. Ooh, now that's samurai armor. Look at that. It's got like antlers as well. Yep, we're upgrading that. This will keep you safe. Perfect. Gosaku armor. Um, that I don't like the hat. The hat's a bit weird, but I like the upgrade on the armor itself. It looks nice, so let's do that. Nothing stronger. Perfect. You have my thanks. Awesome. We pray for your safety. So let's um let's test out our new armor. It's weird that hat. It's just that hat. I'm not not a fan of the hat. But anyway, um, outfit. So without the hat, we can change the color of it. We got like this Sakai half mask and change the color of that as well. Okay, so Kasaku's armor. These are the colors I've got. So nice and orange. Got the red and the sort of the dark one. And Sakai armor. So like full white, which is quite nice. Gold and black. That looks nice. The red one, red and black looks also nice. The black and gold. That one's nice. Actually, they're all nice, to be fair. I think I... Oh, I don't know. A tough choice. I, I like the white one, you know. But the black one looks cool. And the red one... Ooh, tough choice. Let's go with red. Or maybe white. We haven't done a white outfit yet. So let's do white. 
um, we can mix it up a bit. So, Sake mask. So, this was like the first mask. And then, Avenging Lord, Thief's Rat. Could have it with the white mask. Uh, maybe one of these. Maybe the red one. And then the hat. That's our new headband. That one actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> Got the frog in the temple. That looks nice. Match as well. Oh, that actually looks really cool. That reminds me of Yushimitsu with this outfit as well from Tekken. Uh, where's that new helmet we got there? It looks nice. That one's cool as well. That looks nice. That's like proper samurai, isn't it? Yeah, that looks cool. But this, that is badass. Yeah, boy. Look at that. The red one looks good. The, they all look good. The white also. Honestly, I kind of, I, I really like this. But the one that really does it for me is actually this one. I really like that. It's just like your half samurai, half ronin sort of thing. Or maybe we'll just go for, let's go for the full outfit, the Sake clan armor outfit. Let's do the, uh, the white. Just like a pure white outfit. That looks nice. Okay. Uh, so that was it. Oh, and we can change for a white sword as well, maybe. Because that one doesn't match as much. Let's look for a nice white one. That is very white. Yeah, I think it has to be that bottom one, doesn't it? Yep, let's go for that. There we go. That looks pretty cool, if I do say so myself. It's like almost like a druid or something, you know? Okay, that's nice. Where's this bird trying to take me? It's like just flying around here. It wants to show me something. Where are you taking me, Mr. Bird? In here? Okay. I think I've been in here. Maybe I've missed something. Looks like there's a second floor. Can I grapple up on this, I wonder? Yeah, I can. Let's have a look up here. Maybe there's something in here that I missed. Ah, here we go. Supplies. And something here. What's that? Healer's headband. Okay. So it's probably showing me that. Okay, awesome. So, yeah. That that would make a nice screenshot, wouldn't it? Like, with the white armor. Just looks so epic, this game. Like, the armor is, like, really nice looking now. Yeah, that's good. Like it. Like it a lot. Okay. Perfect. So, thank you very much for watching again, and uh, I'll catch you next time.